Imagine creating cartoon animation videos just like this, without expensive software, without animation skills, and in just a few simple steps. Did you know that kids love watching these types of videos over and over again? And the best part? YouTube's algorithm automatically pushes them to millions of views. Let me show you a quick preview of the cartoon animation I created using AI. In a quiet village nestled between green hills, three-year-old Arian lived with his grandfather and grandmother in a cozy little house. Life was simple, but full of joy. Every morning, as the sun peeked over the horizon, Arian would wake up with excitement, ready to help his grandparents with their daily chores. His favorite part of the day was tending to the animals. He would waddle outside in his tiny slippers, his eyes twinkling as he greeted the goats and hens. Now what if I told you that you can start your own faceless YouTube channel and create trending cartoon animations for free using AI? No complicated software, no drawing skills, just four simple steps and AI will do all the hard work for you. By the end of this video, you'll have everything you need to start creating viral cartoon videos that can bring in passive income on YouTube. And the best part? You only need to make one video and upload it to YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram for maximum reach. So if you're ready to let AI be your personal animation studio, let's get started. Step 1. Writing a story. Every great cartoon animation starts with an engaging story, but don't worry, you don't need to be a professional writer. We'll use ChatGPT to generate a simple, kid-friendly script that keeps viewers hooked. Just give it a basic idea. This is the idea I provided to ChatGPT. You can check it out and use it to generate and practice your own story. I've submitted the idea, and now ChatGPT is generating a story based on it, right before our eyes. As you can see, in just a few seconds, ChatGPT has created an amazing 300-word story based on our idea. Once the story is ready, the next step is to generate 12 prompts for it. To keep the characters consistent, I also provided ChatGPT with detailed character traits, including age, hair color, eye color, facial features, clothing, and shoes. I submitted this command prompt and ChatGPT provided two responses. In this case, you can choose either one, but I prefer the first one because it best fits our needs. ChatGPT has provided 12 story prompts for images, but I noticed that character details are only included in the first prompt. Some details are missing in the other prompts, which could cause issues with generating consistent characters in the images. Now I'll ask ChatGPT to add the missing character details and rewrite each prompt to ensure consistency across all images. I submitted this prompt and within seconds, ChatGPT will rewrite each image prompt with complete character details for perfect consistency. As you can see, ChatGPT has provided the image prompts with complete character details and I'm fully satisfied with the results. Now I'll give ChatGPT another command to arrange the story along with each image prompt, making it ready for the voiceover. So I write the command prompt and will copy the story and just after the command prompt I will paste it here and click submit. Within seconds, ChatGPT will arrange the entire story with each image prompt, making it ready for the voiceover. As you can see, ChatGPT has arranged the first scene with its voiceover. Now it's easy for us to know exactly what to narrate in the first scene. And here are the narration words for the second scene, ready for the voiceover. In the same way, ChatGPT has arranged the entire story with narration for each scene, perfectly aligned with the visuals. Just as I mentioned earlier, AI is doing all the hard work for us. First, I provided ChatGPT with a story idea, and it generated an engaging story. Then I gave another command to generate 12 image prompts with character details for consistency. ChatGPT delivered the image prompts, but some were missing character details. So I asked it to rewrite the prompts and include all character details, and this time, the results were exactly as I expected. Finally, I gave another command to arrange the story with each prompt for the voiceover, and ChatGPT delivered exceptional results by perfectly structuring the narration for every scene. Now that our story and image prompts are ready, the next step is to generate realistic images using these prompts. So the step two is text to image. I'll be using two of the most advanced and free text-to-image AI tools, Piclumen and Ideogram AI, to generate the images and compare their results. I'll copy the first prompt and head over to Piclumen.com to generate the image. I've opened Piclumen and I'm already logged in. As you can see, creators are generating stunning, ultra-realistic images using this powerful AI tool. After logging in, simply click on the Create button to start generating your image. Now click here and select the Flux 1 model. In the Dimensions section, select 916. This aspect ratio is perfect for almost all social media platforms. Set the quantity to 2 to generate two image variations at a time. Now paste the prompt and click on the Generate button. Within seconds, Piclumen will create two stunning, high-quality images based on the prompt. Piclumen has generated stunning images, but they look too realistic. Since I need cartoon-style images, I'll refine the prompt by adding 3D Pixar style at the end to achieve the perfect animated look. After adding 3D Pixar style at the end of the prompt, I'll click the Generate button again. It will take a few moments to generate the images again. 
This time, Pickleman has successfully generated amazing cartoon-style images based on the prompt. In the same way, you can generate images using these prompts, just add 3D Pixar style at the end to get stunning cartoon-style visuals. In the same way, you can generate images using Ideogram AI. It's another advanced and free text-to-image AI tool. However, unlike Pickleman, you're limited to only five generations per day. I opened Ideogram AI, and I'm already logged in. Now I'll paste the same prompt and add 3D Pixar style at the end to generate stunning cartoon style images. I selected the same 916 aspect ratio, set the mode to realistic, and clicked the generate button. Within a few seconds, Ideogram AI will generate images based on the prompt. As you can see, Ideogram AI has successfully generated stunning images based on the prompt. And if I show you the Pickleman results for the same prompt, you'll be amazed by the incredible results. In the same way, I'll copy and paste each prompt into Pickleman and Ideogram AI to generate the images. If the results don't turn out as expected, I'll regenerate them until they're perfect. Once all the images are ready, I'll show you the final results. Here are the images I've generated using Pickleman and Adiagram AI. You can do the same to generate stunning images just like these. Now that we have the images ready for every scene, it's time to bring them to life. Step 3. Image to Video I will be using two of the most advanced image to video AI tools, Hiluo AI and Vidu AI. So first, I'll head over to Hiluo AI. I searched for Hiluo AI on Google and clicked on the first link. I'm already logged in, and for those who are new to Hiluo AI, here's a quick introduction. Hiluo AI is one of the most advanced text and image to video AI tools. As you can see, people are generating amazing videos with this tool for free. Hiluo AI offers 100 free credits to every user daily, and you can do three generations with those credits, which renew every day. After logging in, click on the Try Now button. Now we have three options, image to video, text to video, and subject reference. Since we already have the images, I'll select the image to video option. After that, click here to upload the image. I will select the first scene image. It will take some time to load the image. And after that, I will copy the same first image prompt, then paste it here so that Hiluo AI has an idea of how to animate the picture. Make sure to select the I2V01 model and set the quantity to 1 for the best results. Then, click on the Generate button and let Hiluo AI work its magic. It will take some time to generate the video, but the best part about Hiluo AI is that you can submit up to three tasks at a time, and it will continue generating the videos even if you exit the page. So I will delete the first image from here and upload the second image to generate the next scene. And I will modify the video prompt if necessary before clicking the Generate button. Now that I've submitted all three images, Hilo AI will generate three videos from them. To generate more videos, you'll need to create multiple accounts using different Gmail addresses, or you can purchase their paid plan, which starts at $10 per month. Meanwhile, I will head over to Vidu AI. I searched for Vidu AI and will click on the first link. Now click on the Try Now button to start using Vidu AI. Vidu AI offers 80 credits to all new users for free, and unlike Hiluo AI, these credits are not renewable. Here we have two options, image to video and text to video. Since we already have the images ready, I will click on image to video. Now click on the upload image button to add your first scene image. I will upload the first image and then copy and paste the first prompt here to guide Vidu AI in animating the image accurately. These options are for paid users. If you subscribe to the paid plan, you'll have access to more advanced features for generating your videos. So I will simply click on the generate button and unlike Hiluo AI, Vidu AI will generate the video within a few seconds. As you can see, Vidu AI has generated the video within a few seconds. If you're not satisfied with the results, you can simply regenerate it again for better output. And if I show you the results from Hiluo AI, you'll be amazed. Hiluo AI has generated an incredible cartoon style video, bringing the image to life with smooth and realistic animation. In the same way, I will generate videos from all of these images using Hiluo AI and Vidu AI. Once all the videos are ready, I will show you the final results. These are the videos I have generated from images using Hiluo AI and Vidu AI tools. Now that we have the story, images, and videos ready, the next step is to edit these videos in a video editor. I will be using CapCut because it is easy, free, and user-friendly. Step 4. CapCut Video Editing I've carefully organized all the video clips scene by scene to make editing and cap cut super smooth and effortless. For some scenes, I've generated two video variations to ensure the visuals align perfectly with the story narration. Now I'll import all the scenes into CapCut. Next, I'll drag each video clip into the timeline one by one. To keep things quick and efficient, I'll fast forward this part. As you can see, I've imported all the videos into the timeline. Next, I'll crop each video clip to make the main character stand out and look more visually appealing. And once again, I'll fast forward the video to keep things smooth and time efficient. I've cropped all the video clips, and now it's time to add the voiceover to bring the story to life. I searched for Eleven Labs and clicked on the first link. Eleven Labs is one of the most advanced text-to-speech AI tools, offering 10,000 free characters to every user, along with thousands of AI voiceover actors. 
To select the best voiceover for the story, I'll click on the Voices button. Here, you'll find hundreds of free AI voice actors to choose from. But if you want to explore even more options, click on the Library button to find the perfect voice for your story. Here, you can search for your desired voice or choose from the options in the menu below. Since we're working on a story, I'll select the Narrative and Story category to find the perfect voiceover. Now select the Narration language for your story. I will select the English. You can test different voiceover actors and choose the one that best fits your preference but I'll go with this one because it perfectly matches our story. I've already added this voice to my list, so now I'll simply click on the Use button to apply this voice actor. Now I'll copy the first scene's paragraph, paste it here, and click the Generate button to create the narration. Now simply click the Download button to save it to your desktop. In the same way, I'll copy each scene's narration paragraph, generate the voiceovers, and save them to my desktop. Once all the voiceovers are ready, I'll show you the results. Here are the voiceovers I've generated. I've also arranged them scene by scene to make the video editing process smooth and efficient. I've imported all the voiceovers into CapCut, and now I'll add the first scene's audio to the timeline. Now, if you notice, there's a big gap here, so I'll remove it first to keep the timing smooth. Select the audio clip and press Ctrl plus B to cut. Then move the cursor slightly forward and press Ctrl plus B again. Click on the middle empty part and press the delete button to remove the gap. Then drag the last part to seamlessly merge the audio clips together. Now, if you notice, the first scene's video clips are too short compared to the audio. To fix this, I'll add a relevant image here. I highly recommend generating extra images for each scene beforehand to avoid such issues during editing. Now I'll import the image into CapCut and add it to the timeline. After that, I'll adjust the speed of the clips to perfectly align with the audio and ensure a smooth, seamless flow. The first scene is ready. For the remaining scenes, I'll follow the same process, adjusting the speed or adding images if needed to ensure a smooth, seamless flow. I'll fast forward this part to save time. But if you want to understand this part completely, simply slow down the speed of the video. The audio is perfectly aligned with the visuals. The next step is to add transitions for a smooth and seamless playback experience. I'll fast forward the video again to save time. The transitions are added, and now I'll enhance the video with sound effects using Pixabay's free sound library. I searched for Pixabay sound effects and clicked on the first link. Now in Pixabay, I'll search for chicken clucking to find the perfect sound effect. I like the first one, so I'll go ahead and download it. The next sound effect I'll search for is goat sounds. The first one is perfect for our video, so I'll download it to my desktop. For the background music, I'll use YouTube Audio Library because it's 100% safe to use and offers stunning music tracks. Now I'll search for lullaby music here. I liked the Forest Lullaby music track, so I'll download it to my desktop. I've imported the two sound effects and the background music track into CapCut. Now I'll carefully place the goat and chicken sound effects exactly where they appear in the video for a more realistic and immersive experience, and I'll also adjust their volume for the perfect balance. The sound effects are added. Now I'll add the background music, trim the extra part of the track, and adjust the volume to perfectly complement the narration and overall mood of the video. The video is now complete. Now I'll export it to my desktop. I'll export the video in 1080 pixels to ensure exceptional quality and a professional look. The video export has started. Once it's done, I'll show you the final results. Before I reveal the final results, if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to my channel. It truly means the world to us. We're dedicated to bringing you the best content, and your support keeps us motivated to create even more amazing videos. In a quiet village nestled between green hills, three-year-old Arian lived with his grandfather and grandmother in a cozy little house. Life was simple, but full of joy. Every morning, as the sun peeked over the horizon, Arian would wake up with excitement ready to help his grandparents with their daily chores. His favorite part of the day was tending to the animals. He would waddle outside in his tiny slippers, his eyes twinkling as he greeted the goats and hens. Good morning, friends, he would say, his voice filled with innocence. The goats bleated in response, and the hens clucked, as if understanding his words. With his small hands, Arian would carefully scoop up the grain and scatter it for the hens giggling as they pecked eagerly. Then, with a serious expression, he would gather the warm eggs from the nests, holding them as if they were treasures. His grandparents watched with loving smiles, their hearts swelling with pride. Next, Arian would tug at a bundle of fresh grass, struggling a little, but determined. The goats nudged him playfully, eager for their meal. Be patient, he would scold gently, 
feeding them one by one. His grandparents watched with loving smiles, their hearts swelling with pride. The animals had become his best friends, and he treated them with kindness and love. As the sun climbed higher, Arian would sit on a wooden bench. A baby goat nestled beside him and listened to his grandfather's stories. The village was his world, the animals his family, and his little heart was filled with happiness. For Arian, life was not about toys or grand adventures. It was about love, laughter, and the simple joys of caring for his dearest friends. His little heart was filled with happiness.